Yo, what's good? Thank you so much, guys, in the studio. And this morning, I feel like, you know, I need to draw something. I need to let out, you know, my skills, as I would say. I'm not good at drawing at all, but we are here at this wonderful place, which is called the Teja Studio for Arts and Crafts Session, guys. This is located at the Malaysian Tourism Center, and we need to check this wonderful stuff out because it's Bate Painting, man. I mean, Bate Painting has been around since 1920, right? And uh, when it comes to production-wise, 1960, it has like been introduced to the world and of course nationwide as well, right here in Malaysia. Anyway, stay just video. Let's go, man. All right, what's good, guys? So together with me right now, we've got Hafiz, one of the co-founders of Teja Studio. Sooner or later, you'll be seeing his wife because she'll be drawing, correct? Uh, why don't you tell me the history of Teja Studio and maybe even if you want to put in a little bit about Bate all together, tell me some of the wonderful infos that, uh, that you know about. Teja Studio started in 2018. Right. Like previously, we was working with the Bate brand, Bate company, even I also have a batik uh, product where we make a clothes. Right. We think that we need to do something new okay. that close to our generation. Right. Share this traditional knowledge uh -huh. and we go on the educational purpose. Right. Means we do a workshop. Right. On that time, we redo for the tourists anyway. We use the Airbnb platform. Many people coming here to, to learn about batik. Even uh, Malaysian also confused about batik anyway. When people think batik is a design, uh -huh. not a technique, so it makes a confused. Like, uh, oh, you have to something that uh, everyone claiming that. Correct, so correct. the thing is, that we here at Teja Studio, we share uh, batik is a technique anyway. So you can draw anything. You can draw any design that you like with the correct technique and it's still called a batik. If there's something that you want Malaysians and people out there, even maybe our beloved foreigners out there, to take away about uh, one of the most wonderful things about batik, what would it be? They can create their own design. We also share about our traditional design that have a meaning, you know, and that brings a valuable thing to, to bring back home. Especially right here in Malaysia where Bate is definitely something we hold close to our heart as a Malaysian, ladies and gents. And of course, thank you so much, Hafiz. Alright, so you just saw batik colouring and of course the Thai and Dai bandana and right now we are uh, putting the icing on the cake with the art resin. So uh, some of the ingredients used to produce this wonderful art is basically the epoxy resin and we've got hardener and lots of colours to spice things up, right? So remember, bring your friends and family right here at Teja Studio located at the uh, Malaysia Tourism Centre. Search them up on Instagram and they will help you sort it out. Book an appointment right here, right now. Till then, together with Hafiz, Brandon, right here on WhatsApp, this is Fresh Brew. Back to you guys in the studio.